Back again with another motherfucking review. We doing slime th slime season three from Young Thug. Let's see what this nigga got. I usually think he sucks because I can't understand what the fuck this nigga be saying. But anyways, let's get into this shit. With th with them, track one. Hey. That nigga, oh, I ain't gonna lie, this nigga snapped on this hoe. This nigga snapped on that hoe. Man. With them, nigga, this hoe is fire. Track Mimos. Hey, man, this shit actually nice. What is he saying? Ooh. Hey, hey, this is pretty nice, man. Young Thug stepping up his quality. Even though I still can't understand what he's saying. Rarely. Track three, dripping. Dripping, dripping, dripping. I could dab on every intro, young thug. I promise you, watch this. It's why you tell Eddie, you know. Nice thing. I know. Never mind. Was that his version of island people talking, Caribbean people? <laughs> That's trashy. That, that's this song right here, dripping. It, it's not that good. I, I to me, I don't feel like dripping is really good. I don't understand the concept. I mean, to me, I don't feel like that was a good song. And I know I, I'm not gonna just say a song was trash, but like listening to it sonically and lyrically, it's not that. Got okay. It's track four, slime shit featuring Yaka Gotti. What the fuck? Track four is it's it's, it's alright. It's not oh over the fucking shit, but it's it's not over the top, it's like average. It's average. It's not oh my god, you know. It's average. Number five, track five, digit with the survival. I heard he was putting some snippets on his um Instagram and he was it's on the dope. You see what the whole song sound like, you know? See what it's about. We got London on the track. On the track. Nigga, horses don't stop. They keep going. Hey, you can lose your life, but they gon' keep going. Right. But at least we got to say we ran out of digital. We ran out of money. We ran out of digital. We ran out of money. We ran out of digital. We ran out of money. 
Okay. Okay. Part right here, I think it's the hook. The hook is fucking nice. This nigga voice is like a fucking instrument. This was a dope track. It's average too. The hook made it sound so dope, man. It's like. He gives you like the dope hook, but when it comes down to lyricism and like dropping some bars, it's like it's, it's average. It's not something you be like, oh, but the beat, the beat, the beat, man, the beat makes him way better, man. Like the beat is what keeps him going. Six, worth it. Um, if you know what he's saying. Can somebody comment that in the comment section? Because I don't know what he's saying for the hook. Please, just help me. Man, track six, I give it, it's average, man, like, it's like everything he does is average, I think track one was above, track one was the only thing that was above average to me, that shit was like lit, and it had like per good lyrics, it just, it was above average, but like, from everything below that, it's like average, track seven, tattoos, Expecting that beat to drop hard. Come on. There you go. Okay. It's dope though. My question is. Why is his uh, mixtape cover, album cover, why is his eyes bleeding? Can somebody explain that to me? Is it some type of subliminal message or something? Explain that to me, please. I just want to know. Yeah, Sex 7 is dope, I ain't gonna lie. That right there is something you just ride to like, Doof. Gives you vibes, man. I ain't gonna lie, that, that was a little, that's a little dope. Even though I can understand what he's saying. Track eight, problem. Okay, okay. So you gotta go out with a band. This has to be dope. Okay, I knew it. This whole had to drop. Okay. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about, bro. Get in that hole. That was dope, man. I ain't gonna lie, man. This is most abnormal flow. I ain't gonna lie. That nigga really changing the game though. It was a rating and my verdict. 
on Slime Season 3 by Young Thug. I give it a 3.5. Could have been way better. To, I, I don't know if it's just him. That's how he does it. But to me, track one was the best track on the whole, whole the whole album, the whole album or mixtape, whatever he calls this shit. It's dope. Track one. It's just a different feel to it. Everything else is below average. And probably track five with the hook. The hook made it so made it so nice. But you know what I mean? Like, could have been better. He's just not that, you know, he's just he just don't have that it factor to make him go up. But Young Thug, he, he has his own style and everything. I ain't gonna lie. I give it a three out of five. I think this album is, is dope. It's, it's something to ride to, you know. Because the beats, London on the Tracks did, did a great job on this. With the beats and the production. I feel like it's really dope. But, could have been better to me, you know. But, yeah. If you wouldn't have trolled so many... Man, watch it. Subscribe and like. Drop a comment in the comment section if any songs you want to request me to do a review to. Any one of them. But I feel deuces.